Hello everyone, welcome to the U.S. Marine Channel. The Sikorsky CH-53E Super Stallion is a heavy-lift helicopter operated by the United States military. It was developed from the CH-53C Stallion as the Sikorsky S-80, primarily by adding a third engine, a seventh blade to the main rotor, and a 20 degrees cant on the tail rotor. It was built by Sikorsky Aircraft for the U.S. Marine Corps. The less common MH-53E Sea Dragon fulfills the U.S. Navy's need for long-range minesweeping and aerial mine countermeasures missions and performs heavy lift duties for the Navy. The Sikorsky CH-53K King Stallion will replace the CH-53E with a new engine, new composite rotor blades, and a wider cabin. The three-engine CH-53E Super Stallion is a much more powerful aircraft than the original Sikorsky S-65 twin-engine CH-53A Sea Stallion. The CH-53E also added a larger main rotor system with a seventh blade. The CH-53E is designed to carry up to 55 troops, or 30,000 pounds, 13,610 kilograms of cargo with seating along the centerline of the cabin and can carry up to 36,000 pounds, 16,330 kilograms of external lift. The CH-53E is the MV-22B with the same crash attenuated seats that improved passenger survivability, but reduced its troop carrying capacity to 30 citation needed. The Super Stallion has a cruise speed of 173 miles per hour, 278 kilometers per hour, and a range of 621 miles, 1,000 kilometers. It is equipped with a forward extendable aerial refueling probe. The CH-53E is also equipped with a chaff flare dispenser. On October 26, 2001, Three CH-53S aboard USS Peleliu and three CH-53S aboard USS Bataan flew 550 miles (890 kilometers) to secure Camp Rhino, Afghanistan's first land base with a peak force of 1,100 troops. This was the longest amphibious air assault in history. The CH-53E's long-range capability allowed the Marines to establish a base in southern Afghanistan and conduct ground combat. Super Stallions also played a major role in the 2003 invasion of Iraq. They played a key role in bringing supplies and ammunition to the most forward Marine units, as well as moving wounded to the rear and assisting with medical treatment in the rear. Marine Corps CH-53S and CH-46S carried U.S. Army Rangers and Special Operations Forces on a mission to rescue captured Army Private Jessica Lynch on April 1, 2003. Currently, approximately 150 CH-53E helicopters are deployed to the Marine Corps, and an additional 28 MH-53S to the U.S. Navy. The CH-53 requires 44 hours of maintenance per flight hour. Each flight hour costs approximately $20,000.